Hello kings and queens, welcome back to Glam Queen DIY and if you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Now, in today's DIY video, this is my 1960 house much needed cosmetic makeover plus three DIYs. If all of that's are interesting, make sure you keep watching. Don't forget, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on your post notifications. All right, family. Now, this first DIY, you guys, we are going to be updating this cabinet. This is my items. Um, this mirror sheet is from BB Crab. The mirror square sheet is from KGMW. I'm going to put all the links for these down in the description. Make sure you follow me along. Now, you guys, all, all of my items are self-adhesive. So, this is going to be a simple, quick, and easy DIY for you. But, make sure you keep watching. Make sure you watch to the end. And I want to thank you guys for all of your love and support. We truly do appreciate you here on the channel. So, with that being said, let's get these projects finished. And two, I purchased my X-Acto knife from Amazon. You guys, make sure you do check out um, Amazon. And also be making preparation for the upcoming uh, Amazon Prime Day, which is coming in about almost another month. So you guys, make sure you be on the lookout to snag you some amazing items from Amazon Prime. Now, this is my dresser with the mirror sheets on the door I'm gonna also add mirrored tile trim it to trim it all out and we're not even gonna stop there you guys you know a lot of my DIYs do evolve mid process and if you're not accustomed to using mirror mosaic tile to cut glass be very careful. I would recommend putting on some type of gloves because I use them regularly. I don't, but don't do as I do, do as I say. So make sure you're always careful. Now, as you can see here, we are, we are, you guys can't even talk today. We are adding those mirror sheets to the pullout drawers as well. And we're just going to add that to all four. And we're going to do this the same way we did the actual door. We're going to add the mirror sheets. Then we're going to trim the drawers out with mirror as well. And two, a portion of this video is sponsored by BB Craft and KGMW. All of their links is in the description. If you are a content creator and would like to uh, partner with BB Crayer. You just got to have 100 subscribers. I do have all of that information in the description box as well. And you guys, make sure you are always checking out my description box. It is always some useful information for you in that description. And to you guys, I do always leave my affiliate links in there so that you can have use of my discount codes to get you some fabulous products at a great price now you guys i don't receive any money for you using my links and they do not cost you anything extra all i do is receive a small commission now too you guys make sure you do check out my community tab i am going to be posting a poll in there and that poll should be in in that community tab 24 hours after this video airs make sure you do check it out i want you to give me your opinion because we're going to still be doing a little bit of changes here on the channel and i do want to see what type of content you would like your girl to bring so make sure you do check out that community post and still don't forget we do have in this video you guys in this and this in this video we are going to be showing you some more uh makeups 
I'm sorry, makeovers to my 1960s uh, home. So do make sure you do check that out. And we're actually doing a lot of modern updates to the space. But be mindful, we're getting ready to embark on another journey. And we're just trying to get this content out, you guys, so that you can see this new journey we're getting ready to embark on. For this project, we are repainting and updating the hallway. And we're going to do several things out here. I will tell you, as you see here, we're going to paint my, and this is my attic fan. I told you my this house was built in 1963, so it did have the attic fan. I took the faceplate off here. I'm going to take the faceplate off of the alarm system, and I'm going to paint those. <laughs> A different color and I'm gonna I'm gonna surprise you guys with the colors we're gonna paint all of the doors but what I have already done so I can get off the ladder because I'm gonna do this project here without assistance so I've painted all of the top so that only thing I'll be on the ladder for is painting the attic fan we're going to take that down so we can paint it but as you can see here with the different variations of the paint come on clear up camera i had already added in some of the white here but as you can see this is that sherman williams white white this is my i think this is the Glitten regular white, but we've got all the top painted. So, what I'm going to do, we're going to commence finish painting, and I'm turning an angle so that you can't see what's going on. We have started painting this door as well. We're going to update, just do a fresh coat of paint, then we come back. You guys, we're going to come back and you're going to see. It, the final look starting with the pure white we can't show you the bedroom as of yet and everything here right now is kind of under construction you guys but with that being said let's get this job tackled All right, guys, I finished my initial rough cut and I actually came back and coated it twice. So when it dries again, I'm gonna just be doing touch ups. And I do know I got some, some in here to redo, but we finna concentrate on this here on the top, you guys.
All right, you guys, now we're finna go back in with another coat. And I actually couldn't find my paint brushes, so I haven't did any of my trim work. So I'm gonna catch up my trim work and I'm going to go ahead and catch this because this attic fan actually is gonna have to be painted with a paintbrush. This is what it's looking like. I'm gonna add some more paint. And you guys, I'm gonna get a little bit of assistance. That's why I come down. So, once they, once I get my help and they help me finish, we're gonna come back so I don't know how much they're gonna help me do in here, but I'm gonna get some assistance. But this is what it's actually looking like right now. As you can see, we're going to trim it out. So we're going to completely brighten the uh, hallway back up. We do have recess lights going up. So I don't know if the recess lights going up today. <laughs> if I get the help, they're going to go up today. We may need to wait because it's like over in the afternoon right now. So that because we'll have to shut off the power. But we're going to finish this, you guys, and I'll be right back. All right, you guys, we do have it finished. And like I say, we're going to put it up. And we're going to have to wait to put up the recess lights, you guys. Because that is actually what's going in here and in the kitchen and my craft room as well. But the hallway is finished. And I'm going to come back because we told you we're going to uh, add in another um what i'm doing you guys we're painting the doors so i was told <laughs> to wait at least three days because we did paint over these doors so i don't know you guys if i'm going to bring you this video and i probably should bring it so that i can just include that clip on something else because we're trying to get out this all of this filmed content so but we're gonna see but the hallway is finished and as you can see all of the doors are looking marvelous we do still have that bathroom door open and the same color that's going on the doors is going on our doorbell and our alarm uh, system box as well so with that being said now this doesn't include the video we don't know I don't know if we put the DIY in the front or in the middle of half of it. but you guys make sure you watch the whole video because there's a diy in this video somewhere all right you guys that's it for this tiny hallway and please don't forget to subscribe to glam queen the diy and her home is make sure you do check out her home is to see 
the styling and the completed look of my spaces now you guys i'll see you in the next upcoming video